just a smidgen. So five, seven, seven percent. Seven percent sounds good. All right. Who's ready for chess two on the Nintendo Switch, everyone? I can't wait. I am uh, scored by Tim Foley. If it's scored by Tim Foley, I'm definitely going to buy it. I don't have a choice. The chess <laughs> two OST that comes with a free chess two game. Go figure. Hey, ah. hey, hey, if we get a chess two with Tim Foley music, I'd actually be hyped. Right. Oh my God. All right. So we have the discord chat pulled up here. I don't know why it's in such a small letterbox window. The little foogie setup or whatever, but it is what it is. Um, go ahead and get the browser out of the way here. There we go. All right, so I think I think chat can see the window now, so we're good. We, we can see the browser. It goes live in about 27 minutes, so place your bets. You think they're gonna start talking about, uh, think you're gonna start talking about Metroid Prime 4, maybe uh, Streets of Rage uh, 5, who knows? Chess 2 with Tim Fallen, probably. 2023. Chess 2 with Tim Fallen. <laughs> I hope we hear something about Advance Wars at all. Yeah, okay, that we, seems to be the see. general thought for people is that we all want to see something regarding the new Advance Wars, but mm -hmm. yeah. I, I'm hopeful, but I'm not entirely sure. Also, I, I, yeah, I forgot sure. to. I'm mm -hmm. hopeful. I forgot to do the thing, by the way. Um, welcome, everybody. Uh, my name is Joy. Welcome to the stream. There's coffee and biscuits on the table as well as cocoa and tea if you need it. This cup's on me. Please make sure that you wash your hands, don't touch your face, drink water, and wear a mask when traveling in public. We are going to be watching the Nintendo Direct today, as, as evidenced by the big fat red screen that says Nintendo Direct on it. Um, as it suggests, the stream itself will be 40 minutes long, but uh, we're all kind of here to kind of deliberate on, you know, the games that are getting released, kind of getting hype about it, and then talking about what we like, what we're eager for, and what we didn't see. So, uh, yeah, stop on in, hang out, and, you know, for those of you that are eagerly awaiting for the YouTube VOD, I hope you guys got what you wanted out of the Nintendo Direct, because we don't know yet, so we'll we'll see here in a moment. Yeah. And, like, if, because mm -hmm. I, I just want to hear about Advance Wars, because... That is a series that Nintendo will happily just throw under the bus and never talk about again. It's one of the few that it just refuses to acknowledge. I don't understand yeah. it. It made so, so much like, money, but I mean, I guess, fuck it, I guess. I don't know. Nobody nobody likes to talk I mean, about it. It was supposed to, to come point, out last year. To the point but... that there's an entire fan run site to play Advance Wars competitively. Mm -hmm. It is active, highly active every day. <laughs> right. And it's like, between this and, you know, games like Mother 3 and whatnot, it's, these are games that were probably... It's just, Nintendo seems to have a love-hate relationship with some of their games, but as Yui put it, Nintendo is a toy company. You know, once they're done yeah. with something, it's time to move on to the next one. Like, even something as big as, like, Smash Brothers, once Ultimate ended, they... Or, excuse me, during Ultimate's production, they were like, okay, we have to cancel all Melee tournaments, and if you hear anybody talking about a melee tournament, there is no war in bossing say. You know what I mean? Just just cut just cut it right at the neck. But then once Ultimate like stopped, you know, Sora released, the last update got pushed out, and that was all done and over with. Nintendo was like, okay, you guys can have your cake and eat it too now. Let's move on to the next game. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's it's just really unfair, but it, it's it's their company, it's their ball court, so. Yeah. They're a toy company. They're a Japanese toy company. Mm hmm no. Just weird shit. Just just weird shit, but it is what it is, honestly. Like, I won't I won't chastise them for it because it's their company, but I do have every right to be mad about it, so I will be. Exactly. Um let's see. I don't know. Super like Mario Brothers 2. Okay. Super Mario Brothers 2 3, even. Think oh. about it. Just think yeah. about it. There's a third Super Mario Brothers 2, and it features a crossover between Mario and the characters from Doki Doki Panic. I almost said Doki Doki <laughs> Literature for a second. That'd be so weird. This is the goddamn Doki Doki Panic. No, 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 no. We, we just need Wario. Yeah, no. It's, it's Super Mario Brothers 2, 3, but just Wario. Yeah, no, just there is Wario. no Mario Brothers. It's just speaking, in the title. Speaking of series that Nintendo will throw other, under the bus and never acknowledge again, Wario Land. My God! They, well, they just released Wario Land, technically speaking. So did they? Did they, they? There was a in what there format? Was a war, mm -hmm. Or was it Wario Land or Wario Where? Wario Where? Wario Where? Where that's the one. Yeah, no, yeah, Wario, Wario Land is what we need to see, though. They, like, mm -hmm. they talk about. They never talk about Wario Land. 
Right. I like Wario Land. Honestly, they had a lot of developments and everything with it because literally in the instruction booklet, they wanted to separate it from Mario mechanics in a way where it was like, okay, cool. And literally in the instruction booklet, it says point blank, Wario can't die because he simply thinks it's too boring to do so. Like my man literally yeah. chooses, he looks death in the face and says no, and it just goes away. And, and it like that no, that changes in Wario no. Land 4, but at least in Wario Land 4, that was where the creativity kind of hit full circle. Like it was a really generic plot. Yeah. Wario hears about treasure in the middle of the desert. He goes out to get it and ends up in a situation that's more than what he bargained for. That's kind of the plot of the Wario Land games as a whole, but it was done so artistically and atmospherically in the fourth series that it's like, oh my God, maybe it actually is Wario's greatest achievement and nothing else after that. And it's like, okay. Aside from like, it, it what was, was it again? Wario like World, but Wario, still. It was very mm -hmm. thematic. Like everything was very Wario colored. Like the music right. had a lot of brass and really silly like melody lines and shit. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Stream it to Discord. Oh yeah, I probably should do that. Probably would help if you guys I mean, could also really, see it. It's okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, I have an idea though. Uh, let me get a pop-up player, and then I'll stream the pop-up player perspective for you guys, so that way you can see that. Um, that way. Well, no, it doesn't matter. I can stream the perspective. And then you don't have to, and then you don't have to look at the toxic chat in the YouTube stream. Thank God. I mean, either way, I don't actually. Surprisingly, let me stream perspective here real quick because chat mean, yeah, can see I guess it. But you can, like, here, uh, boom. Chat and it's Thank you. Over is this coming through okay for you guys? Yeah. It All is. I see is red. Okay. Yeah. This is basically going to be it until they go live. But oh. Yeah. Uh -oh. uh, your perspective on, live on my end. Like, uh oh, by streaming perspective to you guys, it took perspective away from the Twitch chat. Uh oh. Yeah. Uh, oh, hang on a second. You. It's gone. Let me stop streaming to Discord real quick and see if that fixes it. One moment. Yeah. Say so this focuses on like the first the half. Has started. Oh. It's still just sitting on this screen until five, I assume. But you know. Yeah. Um. Yeah. No. This Ren. It's basically going to be um the first half of 2023 that we're going to be getting for games um mm -hmm. and then you know i think that's kind of my major worry is that they're going to be talking about games that are launching now you know between yeah. now and you know july at the absolute latest but we're looking between now and june and it's like okay so basically what you're trying to tell oh, that's my discord chat so basically what you're trying to tell me is we're most definitely not going to be getting any news on uh, on Breath of the Wild or whatever it is. Breath of the Wild um, comes in the first half. It does? Okay, yeah, I'm late. It's in May, right? Nice. Yeah. Is it in May? I'm so slow. I'm, All right. well, I'm excited. That, that they're going to be spending the last 10 or 15 minutes absolutely. of this presentation just jerking off Tears of the Kingdom. Oh, absolutely. Probably. Uh, yeah. When you put it that way. I can see that happening. I mean, they're definitely well, going to be letting way, some tears out, that's for sure. No, Sorry but, about yeah, that, Breath chat. Of the Wild was coming out, they dedicated the entirety of their presence at E3 2016 to just nothing but Breath of the Wild. Yeah. It's the moneymaker. So, what do you expect? Okay, one second. Yeah. I mean, and it's funny because I remember when they announced Breath of the Wild, they had like this entire like 40 minute or hour long thing with like other games. And then at the end, we just got Breath of the Legend of Zelda, the movie trailer, like what basically like d okay so let me see if twitch can see this twitch can it's see basically, basically you're good marvel movie trailer but for breath of the wild <laughs> so you guys can see the pop-up player right yes okay yeah. i don't know if it's going to be in the best possible quality but i have it being shown through a pop-up window so that way i can have the whole browser for Twitch, and then thankfully um, Enhancer for YouTube has a little extension which allows me to have a little pop-up window, and I can stream that to you guys. So nice. hopefully both of these perspective, hopefully both of these perspectives, excuse me, will show up well for you guys as well as it shows up for my Twitch friends here. So thank you. Of course. Um, nope. Let me actually, in the meanwhile, while we wait for that, let me see if I can get the Discord chat to. Change its width be beyond 800. By like a minute from each other, and it'll be fine. Yeah, that's the fun part, though. <laughs> okay. Okay, hey, I, I made you guys too big now. Uh, 
hearing a minute difference reminded me when Twitch used to have a 30 second to a minute difference between the streamer and chat itself. Mm -hmm. It's like, oh my God. I just, I just mean that I'll be watching it with people in a VC like many times before and we'll mm -hmm. just be desynced from each other by like up to yeah. a minute. Right. Mm -hmm. All hopefully the uh the hopefully the discord stream fast. will help keep you guys together though that's what i'm hoping yeah. for yeah hopefully that's the idea no it should yeah. pretty sure because i do remember the last time we had a direct and there were some people that were ahead and some people that were behind so people were getting yeah. hype for shit we couldn't see yet and it's like wait wait wait, wait what happened <laughs> yeah exactly that, I mean... <laughs> that, that, that's like that always happens to someone when i'm when when I'm watching these with a group, it's like no. That's why so. we always. That's why we have the stream. Thankfully, yes. Um, yeah. I'm trying to change the proper width of the fugi so that way I can spread you guys out a little bit. But there we go. I think that'll do it. Dance, dance, revolution, Mario mix two. Think about it. Think about I it. I mean, I'd be I'd be down for that. Right. I don't think we'll ever get that because James Dance Revolution is owned by Konami, and unless you can make money via Pachinko Machine or some sort of other arcade cabinet, they're not going for it. He doesn't care. Right. Still he bugs the shit out of me. Do, don't crush my dreams like that. Remember yeah. when, like, console gaming what? sought to replace arcades as a whole? And for the most part, it did in most circumstances. Did, yeah. And now Konami wants to cling to the fact that, no, arcade machines still make money. And, you know, Pachinko, it's mainly the patchy slots. It, That's it. it yeah, they, like, don't, they, they don't even do arcades. It's just Pachinko machine. Mm -hmm. Konami's like, if, it, if you can make it into a Pachinko machine to bleed people dry, Konami's interested. Otherwise, right. I'm not. Also, that everything? Anger mentioned we might get a teaser for a new Metro, for a new Monster Hunter game, and it's like, did wait, Anger didn't Monster Hunter just drop its newest like, like DLC though, or not DLC update for Velcana and whatnot though? I thought they still had more updates to go. Why would they? God, hmm? It's been so long since I've been in Monster Hunter Rise. Yeah, and like Sunbreak was guy in like July or August or something last year, so. It was early, yeah, it was late last year, but I mean, if they release a new Monster Hunter game, that'd be kind of funny. But I don't know, Monster Hunter Didn't World they just Two. One. Mm -hmm. Monster I Hunter Stories Three. There we go. That Stories Konami, Three. There not, we go. Not, not uh, Konami, but I imagine Capcom is probably having all hands on deck right now to sort of work on Street Fighter Six. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. yeah. Okay. Okay. I had to look it up. Sunbreak was June 29. So yeah, it was like the summer. Gotcha. Like you know, Capcom's going to have their hands busy across this entire year, honestly. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah. you know, uh, as Frigid was, I was just about to say it and Frigid beat me to it. Um, they have a lot on deck right now. They have Monster Hunter Rise updates to push through. They have Street Fighter 6. And then they have the Arknights collab to look forward to because they're collabing with that. Um, they're going to have a Monster Hunter slash Arknights collab um, or vice versa. Arknights slash Monster Hunter collab since it's Arknights' game. Um, yeah. But, you know, the Capcom for once is going to have a pretty busy year. And, you know, knowing Capcom, you know, how they were how, where they where they, they were at their best with their money grubbing ways where it's like how we had like nine street fighter four games and wacky street fighter five dlc i feel like yeah. capcom is actually starting to do a little bit better as a company as far as like yeah, what they're like doing for their games and we're whatnot. hitting the capcom renaissance absolutely right. mm -hmm. yeah capcom and other developers are learning that you can't just push out half complete live service games to people and they'll buy it anyway because right so there very... was that whole thing where like the last couple of months or something so many live services are just crashing and shutting down right sure. honestly it's business like games as a service is kind of hit or miss because it's like okay cool you know for for games like guilty gear i'll definitely pay for every bit of dlc it has because it does it right you know what i mean none mm -hmm. of the characters that they have are pay to win and a lot of them are just really cool and worth having so it's like they're gonna make a whole entire original new character i say original but you know, some of these are returning characters, some are new, but they still make these characters and it's like, naturally they're gonna slap a price tag on them versus I have to pay for one half of the game on release and the other half of the game down the road 
for what reason? You know, I don't I don't like yeah. DLC practices like that where I mm -hmm. buy a, a half made game to buy the other half. It's like if I go to a sandwich store and I buy the bun and everything, but the burger itself is separate. The patty, the lettuce, the mm -hmm. tomato, everything is separate yeah. from that. And that doesn't make sense to me. I don't like that. $60. Reject, but, reject DLC return to expansion pack to an already complete game. Would, would you like to pay $69.99 for a bun? I would yeah. argue there is a, a key and fundamental difference between a live service game and, and something like Strive, which, right. which, which launches with like a DLC roadmap. Mm -hmm. DLC roadmap is just extra content that they're going to mm -hmm. add to the game that they did not have time to properly add before the game's launch. Right. And Strive Keyword was already extra. delayed for years just to, to get it out in the state that it was in, but at the very least, that launched as a full, complete retail game mm -hmm. without core features or mechanics exactly missing. Right. Like Street Fighter V, with <laughs> which just launched with the bare bone stuff and still tried to sell it for a full $60 with a DLC roadmap on top of that. Right, yeah. they tried and to charge other characters as a premium because it's like, okay, cool. So what comes in the base game? Uh, Ryu, Ken, some chick named Laura, Armika comes back and maybe Zangief. And then it's like, okay, cool. Yeah. Where's Guile? Oh, he's DLC. What do you mean Guile is DLC? Guile <laughs> that is doesn't DLC. make any sense. Yeah. Yeah, and oh. that's what I said, like, when you, in the old days, when you had an expansion pack to an already complete game, and you just added more stuff to it that was extra. Like, right. <clears throat> Tekken 7. <clears throat> Look, I'm just saying, I... Tekken 7 was really rough on DLC, and it felt so incomplete. I'm so mad. What were you going to say, Yui? I'm sorry. I will, all... I know I, I bring these up a lot whenever we discuss games, but honestly, wrestling games do a lot of things that I wish more developers would start doing because out like... of all the games that I have bought, I would say within the past decade, mm -hmm. of all the games I bought, there have been none that have felt consistently like you're getting the full package of everything that you're going to get as much as wrestling games because they launch with mm -hmm. a roster. It, it, it's essentially, yeah, it's a sports game, but they launch with a, with a roster of at least... 60 to 70 uh, characters on the disc itself right with with only like two or three packs of dlc that add an additional 15 or such like a, a fraction of that right which you don't need and all the other content that they push out like extra moves extra entrances all that stuff is free along with their uh, community creations plus that's cool mm -hmm. yeah. wrestling games always launch with a full like a full creation suite a full season mode a, a story mode a manager mode all these different modes and everything but i can't think of one game genre or series that also has regular releases like at least every year or every other two or three years that can consistently launch with the same amount of content that wrestling games can produce on a yearly basis exactly wrestling I, I will say i will say really weirdly consistent about having a full package at launch and just adding like some legacy characters and stuff for funsies is super robot wars of all things right i i do enjoy srw for that but i mean on the wrestling perspective of it that's actually a really fantastic dlc practice for not for, for lack of yeah. a better word honestly because it's like yeah it is guilty gear comes close to that in a way where it's like if you bought the base game with absolutely no season passes none of the characters and whatnot right at worst ignoring the characters all you're missing is just extra color packs right mm -hmm. um so you still get a full game you still have a complete game with every character that fits somebody's play style, you know? Somebody as easygoing as Soul Bad Guy or Kai Kisk or more in-depth characters like Zato One or Eno, for example, you know? So it's like, there's always the, the, there's like characters that anybody can get into versus characters that veterans can get into. And, and all of the July. DLC characters are the in-betweeners, you know? Going back to the, uh, the topic mm -hmm. of DLC practices, it really does come down to the genre of game. And right. also the life cycle for development, because Call of Duty. the genre will affect the life cycle. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. But you know, because uh -huh. 
fighting games, they have their roadmap set. Like they have season passes for a reason, you know, like other games have season passes, but when fighting games do it, it's usually in the way of like King of Fighters, for example, they had whole teams in their first season pass and their second part of the season pass or second season pass rather is individual characters. Like right now they just dropped Shingo mm -hmm. and the next one is Mr. Fancy Pants himself, Kim Kefwan, right? So they went yeah. from dropping full character, full teams to individual characters. The full teams cost a bit more than the individual characters, but the indie characters are there in case, hey, I want to play just this character without the team and whatnot. So they have those. Yeah. But in terms of like shooting games, for example, like Call of Duty and how they do their season passes, it's like you kind of get maps with them. There's There might be a gun that might be a little bit more unique, like Ghosts, for example. What's the name of that one gun in like Ghosts where it could be shifted between like an SMG and an AR? And that apparently uh, no. destroyed the meta for a bit. Peacekeeper. Yeah, Peacekeeper. That's the one. Peacekeeper, that thing yeah. was really strong for the only reason that it could switch gun types in the middle of like combat. And it's like, okay, cool. What other gun can do that? None of them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> none, none of them. You either had an yeah. AR or an SMG or just had the had the uh, perk that lets you had both. But, you know, rip your pistol, I guess. I don't know. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah. I've always felt like season passes for shooting games are weird. That's not to say, though, that fighting games are perfect for their season passes, considering Dead or Alive 5. Um, and the yeah. fact that, like, all of its season, all of all of its DLC put together is over a $1,000 bill for a fighting yeah. game. And it's like a very, very, not even a fraction, but a decimal point of that um, of that $1,000 DLC package is characters. And the remaining amount of it is just costumes after outfits, after costumes. And it's like on one hand, oh, yeah. well, Joy, it's just outfits. I mean, if people want to pay that much for outfits, go nuts. But go that's nuts. still a lot of fucking money for DLC. Yeah. You know what I mean? Let's yeah. not forget that Dead or Alive 5 has like five or six DLC uh, season passes that are $92 each and yes. each one of those passes has an exclusive outfit that you can only get with that season pass. That's correct. Yep. You can't buy the outfit individually. That's mm. kind of annoying, but I mean, that was that's an example of fighting games at their worst DLC practice. And then somewhere in between that is Bandai Namco and how they do their DLC practices because you have like DBFZ, where it's like, okay, cool. So we have a complete roster, right? We have nine Gokus and two different Vegetas. Perfect, we did it. Okay, roster complete. We have nine Gokus and two Vegetas. So what do we do for DLC? Uh, three more Gokus, which all destroy the meta. Um, fucking Cooler, for some reason, who was really strong on release. Mm -hmm. yeah. Videl, who was really awful on release. And then Android 21 with the lab coat, which was their, their complete thing, you know? Ignoring Gogeta and what he was, we, we got you got to admit that in Lab Coat 21 was kind of a mess, honestly, yeah. because it was an example of we're going to make people pay five dollars to win. And that's it. Mm -hmm. Five dollars by the character you win, period. And after the entirety of the, you know, after the game kind of slowed itself for a bit, they started nerfing characters. Season one broken characters. Season two, nerf season one, make season two better. Then as the seasons go on, they kept on axing and rebuilding. And then when the final release for Lab Coat 21 comes out, it's not until the game actually finishes its development cycle that they're like, okay, nerf her too. GG's, have fun. I hope you guys enjoyed your pay. <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed paying $5 for a character that was broken. And it's like, oh, I see. Broken. So it was all reaching for my wallet. Yep. Same goes for like how they did it with Tekken and how like Robin mentioned it earlier, but like Tekken for a huge example is Noctis Lucis Kylum was a force to be reckoned with and then nerfed him. And then Leroy Smith comes out absolutely broken, nerfs him. Fakum Ram comes up and it's like ab dominates the neutral on every particular basis, nerfs him into the ground. So it's like they, they have this funny practice of we're going to release a DLC character make them a paid individual DLC character, give them the strongest buffs possible, and once we announce the, the latest DLC character, nerf it into the ground. Guilty Gear doesn't yeah. do that. Guilty Gear has characters that are all 
unique in their own play style. Like, arguably, people would say that Happy Chaos is a pay to win button. I would say that Happy Chaos requires you to break your fucking fingers to play him optimally, but he is still one of the strongest DLC characters and is still very outmatched by most of the cast, if done right. Yeah. But Great otherwise, fighter. it's like headaches. Like character that's real strong if you're able to burn claw and break your fingers, because some people are willing to do that. Street Fighter aside, since they don't really do it all too much in Street Fighter outside of occasional cameo characters from their older uh, IPs, mm -hmm. like uh, like that. Um, they fighting games also, especially with the the bigger budget legacy ones. Like I, I would argue that the four main pillars of fighting games, as far as bringing people into the genre and keeping the genre alive, mm -hmm. as far as sales wise and making publishers understand that they're profitable i would say are mortal kombat street fighter tekken and smash brothers correct like and i will not argue that that's actually fact go on like i said street fighter aside there is one thing that the three of those games have had in common especially with their newest releases in their dlc and it's guest characters Mm -hmm. Now, Smash Brothers can be excused since that's nothing but a guest character fighting game. It, 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 it's 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 supposed. It's to be the entire that. basis of it, yeah. Mm -hmm. But Tekken and Mortal Kombat have a huge roster of characters that have not been in a game for a long time, or just one-off characters that have never came back in favor of just bringing in uh, Akuma. weird re replacements. Like, when what's what's Tag tournament aside, since they're kind of just wacky, nonsensical games, what was the last game that uh, Bayek was in? Beck Dosan, aside from Tekken Tag Tournament, was Tekken 5, I want to say. Tekken 5 okay. and Tekken 5 Dark Resurrection, which released on the PS2 and PSP about a decade ago now, if not mm -hmm. close to two decades. Yeah. Right, right, right. And... <laughs> How many That's games one. was the character that I would say was one of the top three most popular new characters that they introduced in that game? What was the last game that Takeda was in? Um, just Mortal Kombat X. Aside from, like, maybe the comics and everything like that, Takeda was only in Mortal Kombat X. Right. And who did they decide to put in Mortal Kombat 11 with all their DLC and everything? Not Takeda. <laughs> Unfortunately, Terminator. Terminator. Yeah, yeah. Joker. I mean, it's it's like how Tekken Seven had. Okay, here's uh, Ak Akuma. Here's Geese Howard. Like, <laughs> yeah. In that case, it's like guest characters. But as far as like original characters go, Takedo felt like a one-off. But they gave him the most attention to detail for no reason. Like, yeah. not not for no reason. He's a well fleshed out character. But they put him in and then immediately axed him in the following game. Meanwhile, we still have Cassie Cage and Jackie Briggs for some fucking reason. Yeah. Also, we go live in like 10 minutes, so I'm gonna go ahead and dumb the music down here and let it ride. You mean 10 seconds? 10 seconds, I said 10 minutes, I'm dumb. Anyway, what do you mean live in 34 minutes? What time is it? Nintendo, you have some questions to answer. You said I mean, 4 p.m. and you said, God damn it. I there was gonna go. say if it if it still has that like waiting thing for you, then like that disappeared half an hour ago for me. No, it just oh oh it's starting oh. now. Oh, hang on. Here we go. Oh, just let me refresh time. the page real quick. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, let me turn the volume. Oh, I have to turn the volume down on one of these. Why? Uh -oh. <laughs> yeah, that's Pikmin. Oh uh, hey, yeah, you know, Pikmin. 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 Oh, yeah. All right. I'm I'm here for Pikmin. Oh, it's cool. Pikmin! Yep. Pikmin 4, let's Pikmin. go! Yes! When's the let's release date? I'm here for Pikmin. Oh yeah, they they announced this the last time, right? Right. Yeah, yeah. they did. Yeah. Actually, I think they first announced this in like 2015 or 2016, and then they just shut I think the Twitch stream years. might be a bit delayed. I'm so oh my god, it's the burning guys, yes! Oh my god, the environment's so pretty, dude! What? Are those That's my backyard. Stars? Tiny Snagrid with like no snake body, just the head. It looks like it. This or stream's a little bit delayed, I'm sorry. Who the hell is oh, this? What? New Not character? Oh, who's this new character. I'm 
Ryan. Oh yeah, the Twitch stream might be a bit delayed, so I'm probably gonna have to okay, find a different perspective for this. I'm sorry. Where's the infinity pellet? <laughs> oh my god, this perspective! Yeah. Okay, it's, the, it's the Pikmin, it's the Pikmin 3 onion. Multi? Oh, multi onion? Oh, yeah, it's nice. the Pikmin 3 onion that combines. Okay. Due to the kind of game Pikmin is and how good this game looks, how much you want to bet this game is not going to run that well on the Switch? Probably. It might. We'll see. I'll have to turn. Let me grab the. Let me grab the picture and picture the real quick. Yeah, that's that's hit or miss with. With uh, Pikmin, honestly. Hang on. Ice Pikmin. Oh, okay. Ice Pikmin. Ice? Hello. All right. All right. Oh shh. Oh, All it right. freezes, yo! Nice. That's so it hype. And it, Freeze and water. If yeah. You beat them fro if you beat them frozen, uh, they break like the petrified oh, ones. Oh, water. Right? Yeah. Dog. Doggy. Dog. 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 Oh my God, it's an ally. Yes. Dog. Yeah. Oh, let's go. Wait. Tutsugeki. Oh, is he? Tutsugeki. Wait, is there a four-person multiplayer? Oh, oh you can ride the dog! Oh that. my god! Can, this can is lit! Yo! Pick me right, Let's go! Ochi? Yes. That's its Ochi. name is Ochi! Ochi! Oh, oh I'm in love with this creature! The a, cat, oh, a castaway! A castaway? Not Whoa, what is, what is this? What is this boss fight? What is this boss fight? Oh, it's a long legs! It's a long legs! Yeah, it's a long legs. Oh my god! The Empress Shear oh, Grub, yes! I thought it was Quadraxis. Yeah. Don't stop that. So we're going back to Pikmin 2 dungeons then. So, all right. All right, nice. Pikmin 2 dungeons, nice. And uh, like, I uh, like Castaway. Empress Bull Blacks, that's it. Is, not someone who is part of our crew, but Right, right, right. Four. Pikmin 4. Looks like a four person multiplayer at that. We'll see. Yeah, I'm happy. So no release date. Oh, let me shut up, shut up, hang on. Oh, oh. That's scary. Inner beast. Nighttime enemies? Inner oh, okay. Yeah. Oh my god! July 21st! I can't wait. Okay. July 21st. Alright. I'm Shinya Takahashi. Let me yeah, see if I can pause uh, and resume and pause and resume the stream. Hang being on. Being on the planet surface at night, that never been done in Pikmin. For Pikmin 4. That's like Shinya. it was always you leave like the planet at night because it's more dangerous. Shh, 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 shh. We can't listen. Will it show us? Please look forward to more information in the future. Let's see our first batch of Nintendo Switch. Okay, I managed to catch up with the uh, picture and picture stream. This new hero oh. is a real gem. Oh, oh. Is introducing oh it is! Three of the Xenoblade oh. Xenoblade. Three oh, wow, that is such a VTuber-ass design. Hello? Yeah. It is. Masha? That, that looks much better than the say leak. Hello to Masha, oh. The hero and a refined oh. Lapidus. Hi. Hello? Woman? Ooh, ooh. Oh, accessories? Challenge battles. You can craft on the go. Also being added. Select only one character and battle wave after Oh, gauntlets. Okay. Oh, nice. For every win, oh. you learn more heroes and special abilities. Roguelike? Whoa, Who's hold on. Roguelike? Hold a roguelike in Xenoblade? Shut up. You might also get Dang it, I gotta go play it again. Oh my god. Where's Yuto? Where is Yuto? Where is he? Xenoblade? Oh, oh, hang on, hang on. Oh, Tell me why. Is this really what you want? No way. I'm gonna get through to him. Yeah. He's a heartless machine! Wow, they fixed their design. What is he doing there? No! I... Ah! Was that the one from the first game? Hold on. Three of the Xenoblade Chronicles 3 expansion Who is that? The Xenoblade Chronicles 3 game February 15th. Okay. Switch system, Yo, February Wait, we're getting the story volume 3? Holy crap. Amigo? Amigo? Oh my oh, god! Amigo! Amigo. I didn't know anybody remembered Amigo! Samba de Amigo! I haven't played it, but I remember it. A game it was in. As a game. Sega stays winning. Why? Sega stays winning. This looks like the exact same... Yeah, this, this looks like the exact same rhythm game UI that's in the Persona game. Right. I have, Frigid said I haven't seen that since Billy Hatcher. Same. Oh, high fives? Yeah, Yo! Really this looks fun. This, this really looks, looks great. Fun. Wait. Finally, a modern day amigo. God damn it. Oh, love checker? Make sure to show up in character style. creator, <laughs> yo! Nice. Character customizer, <laughs> rather. World party, alright. Co-op co rhythm. 
Goku Her versus Resident Evil. Elimination like online tournament. Songs you can tell the Xbox Connect is eating its heart out right now. The world. Oh, it is. <laughs> so grab those controllers and get, get shaken. shaken. That's it. Amigo, Party Central. Oh, Summer 2023. Okay. All right. What's next? Oh my God. Oh, what the hell is this? I was afraid of this. Here we go. Uh oh. Yeah. Wait, right. Here we go with the, go with the throw. Fashion like, Dreamer by Exceed Games. And express uh, here we go with Exceed Oh god. my god. A stylish and influencer. No way. It's a Final Fantasy 14 simulator. Let's go. Wait, why does this look like wrong. it's from 2010? Probably because it's where it's based on. Yo, this Animal Crossing yeah. DLC, though. This is so hype. Wait. Yo, and they said they were done with Animal Crossing New Horizons. They just made a whole new game out of it. They really did. Yeah, actually. It's the exact UI. It's the exact UI and everything. The fuck? It is, it is, it is. Nice. Oh, that's exactly cool. You can get the items other people are wearing by simulator, baby. I mean, usual exceed stuff. You can steal their drip easy. Literally just reach into their soul, pull out their drip, and put it on you. Connecting online, you can expand your friend circle and grow your brand. Oh my god, she looks so tired. All right. It's like it's like going outside, but without going outside. It's not even like going outside. It's like getting dressed without getting dressed. I see you up there on the top left, marvelous. So so perfect for VTubers. You never get dressed. Yeah. Oh, Del Dark Worlds? Dark Worlds. Dark Worlds. Oh. Dracula's Castle back in Castlevania? Oh, oh, yeah. Dead yeah. Cells Return oh, to Castlevania. Dead I forgot they talked about this. Yeah. yeah. I need to get Dead Cells Return. I need to get this. I love Castlevania so much, and Dead Cells crossing over with it is so sick. Do you not have Dead Cells yeah. No, I don't. I thought about getting it, but I need to wait on that. This is a sick crossover. This is such an easy crossover. Yeah. It's a sick crossover. Let's go. Dracula. 51 songs from the Castlevania. 51 songs? Songs? Quest, nice. Dead cells, Reaper! Smash Bros. Eat your heart out with your 30 Castlevania song. Oh my god. That's so sick. Oh. Enter a and they add just add Tron. Rector, all Tron right. Identity? What is... The Tron? Universe. Uncovered what? Tron Visual Novel? And retrieve what was lost as you navigate you dodge the light cycle. You know, I don't want to sound like a negative Nancy, but this game was very cheap. What, the Tron game? And the yes. Yeah, it's... I played the first Tron game on Wii and it was fun. This just looks like a Tron Visual Novel. It doesn't look too yeah, bad, but... Like like the end. There. Oh! No Ghost way! Trick. No way! No way! Ghost Trick! Go check Phantom Detective! No, no. What did we say? What did we say? Capcom is starting to win. This is the Capcom revolution. Here we go. I have never heard of this. This is a sick detective. It's so nice. It's so nice. It's like a game for DS. Yeah. Oh, very underrated. Is this a DS game? This was a DS game. It was a DS game, yeah. Yeah. I remember this one. Oh. Hmm. Hold on. Let's go, Ghost Trick. Connected worlds. Ephemer worlds. One suspenseful thriller. Ephemer? Ooh, Ooh, I like Dragon Pass. Oh. Need for Speed Persona. <laughs> Need for Speed Persona, stop. It kind of does look like that. Oh. Deca Police? What's oh my god. Drip Check? I like this art style. It's so sharp. Oh no, they got the Kingdom Hearts chambers. How do they look like? Why do they look like Rooster Teeth animated oh, this, characters? Oh, this is open. Wait. They kind of do. I see what you Hmm. What do we got here? Okay. Detective base game. Gotcha. I kind of expected right, from the yeah. time. Oh my god. Detective base Danganronpa? Wait, wait, combat? Wait. Wait, wait. I'm fighting you and asking you questions at the same time? Oh, this is so fashionable. I love this. This style is so nice. You're under arrest. Go to jail. I want to play this. This is so sick. Wait. This looks, this looks kind of cool. Oh, turn into a cat. Kingdom Hearts. What is happening? Uh, Code Lyoko. This does look kind of fire, you. actually. Yeah, I like this. So it's basically Ace Attorney RPG. Yeah, Ace Attorney RPG. Ace Attorney RPG, yeah. 
Oh, oh the cool. oh my god, he's a Quincy! Yo! He's a Quincy! Deck of police! Five. Definitely grabbing this. I don't have a choice. This is sick. Either a Quincy or like we're trying to do Astral Chain again. Oh, the Bayonetta game. The Bayonetta prequel, yeah. This, this, this look so different and interesting from the Bayonetta Origins. Cereza. The caption spelled that way wrong. Cereza. Oh. A young witch in training. I love how they changed the gameplay. For the this art game. style in this kind of reminds me of Super Paper Mario for some reason. I like it. It's got Super Paper mm -hmm. Mario sense and a bit of like Alice Madness Returns a bit. Right. Mm -hmm. This is a significantly different art style and I'm jiving with it. It's so nice. I love it. It's like the yeah. storybook art style and it's mm -hmm. great. Oh, the colors. Oh. So oh cannot nice. attack and can she can't attack, but she can use her demons. Okay. <laughs> My demons are inside me. <laughs> are the demons in the room with us right now, Sariza? <laughs> All right. <laughs> I am the demon. <laughs> what are you talking about? Are you guys going to port Extreme Versus to Switch? If oh, wish. Wish. Okay, more powers. I want to play that game on something other than my, than my PlayStation. And battles can be more easily swayed okay. in your favor. Can Cereza and Cheshire find their happily ever after? Oh god, we got mechanics in here? We got the we got the Super Mario Sunshine boat mechanics? Aw, oh, man. Oh, yeah. God, no. <laughs> Return to the fucking lily pad. March 17th. All right. That's really soon. How will we die? Next, Return please don't give us even though oh, they're hang like on. bad. They or want to give us Hang on, hang on, hang on. Breath of the Wild 2. Oh, oh Splatoon Lord. 3 oh. DLC already? Splatoon 3. Nice. Splatoon 3 already. Do we already have Splatoon 3 DLC? Hang on a second. No, this is just Splatoon 4. Uh, shut up. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, Splatoon 3 DLC? All right. Octo okay. Expansion 2? Wait, 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 wait. Octoware Expansioner. Platoon 3.5. Oh, what is this? <laughs> 3 .5. Let's go. This looks right? like the old city. Huh? D it, wait, 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 wait. This is the old city. Yeah. It is. Shut up. Shut wait, up. No way. We're back. Oh my games? god, it's them. Oh, wait, this actually looks kind of high. Yeah. Yeah! Nice. Incopolis? Wait, 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 Yo, we're coming back. No way, we're, we're going, going back. back! We're going back! The we're going back inside to the first platoon. Make this splat-tastic place. Splat-tastic place, all right. Your stomping ground. Yeah. So wait, if this is the first part of the expansion pass, are we going to get the split? Jalonzo! Oh my god, Annie! I think this is, you actually get to change your hub world. Oh my god. Products here are the same as the one. Yes, dude. So it's the one. It's the same drip from Splatoon One, also. So they're retroactively bringing back their old drip. Nice. Yep. Well, time to go get Splatoon Three. Well, now I gotta get Splatoon Three. Shit. Oh, dude. You got a beard now? Oh, hold on. Splatoon Two. It's them. It's them. The Squid Sisters. Let's go. The Squid Sisters. Yeah. Yes, dude. Well, now I'm already excited for Wave no, 2 because that means we're going back to Splatoon 2. I, I, I think we have Maria Calliope. It's, it's Marie Calliope. <laughs> Marie Calliope. Marie Calliope. This spring, too. That's so soon. All right. That is very soon. My wallet's not ready for this. It's like they know tax season is coming. Yeah. Oh, they know. They know. They, they definitely know. They coming after. Know. Hey, Joy. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What's this? Breath of the Wild. I knew it. No. See? What? No. What? Is what? Too soon. It looks interesting. What? No. 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 Oh, what is this? Near? That's a cat, isn't it? No. Shh. 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 Near? Oh. No. no wait. It's still too. Splatoon. Oh. It's still Splatoon. Yeah. That's that's a Splatoon person. You get to paint the town. Paint wait. The town. No. Oh. Shut. Is that actually what it is? Wait. 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 Paint the town black. You know what this is? Yeah. 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 Yes. Not just the first. Splatoon 3 expansion pass. Side order. Oh, never mind. Paint the town black. Oh, this is really back. pretty. Paint Good lord. Paint the town black and blue. Are we underwater?
I we can't be. If we're underwater, then they can't swim. Are we under ink? Okay. Wave two is side order. Okay. The launch in the future. Okay. So the expansion pass includes both wave one and wave two DLC as it's released. Okay. That's I gotta see this. All right. Many Side people have played good. Splatoon 3 I since its launch. Be Thank you all very much. very much. You're welcome. I haven't played it yet, but you're welcome. I've played it. I've played it. I've played the, played the, played the, played played the demo. I'm actually Please like forward to more information A about Splatoon 3 in, in the future. So like, yeah. Let's see some more Nintendo Switch headlines. Yeah, more indie games. Let's go. Oh, wait. No, wait, wait, wait. This isn't an indie game. Wait a second. Friends on Illusion Island. Oh my god, Kingdom Hearts? This is old style Mickey, like original Mickey. It is! Don't call her at 3 a.m. Don't call Minnie Mouse at 3 a.m., guys! Say, fellas. Did somebody mention the door to darkness? Mana. Say the door to darkness? Oh, this is nice. Wait. Run, jump, and switch. Oh my god, it's Rayman! On the, uh, It's Rayman. I was gonna say Rayman, yeah. Or so, Commando, get another board. Disney platformer. All right. Places and find secret areas. I can see All this right. being co-op. Oh this my god, Disney Fancy Pants Adventure? Jump. Imagine. Ground pound is this also made by Buena Vista Games? It kind of reminds me of like a... Distant platforms and hidden Wasn't there a Castle of Illusion on like Genesis or something? Oh! That's what I'm thinking of. Oh, four-player! Okay! Yeah, cool. Yeah, I called that. For extra help. Aw, oh, you can share HP. Yeah. Leapfrogging for longer. Oh my God! You can leapfrog to BLJ. Oh, where's the stairs? We liked what Kirby was doing with uh, health, so we. we While exploring the island, you'll meet on you hug instead of him. All right. Ooh. Oh my God! Rogue Legacy. Figure out the secrets to victory. Sick. This actually looks pretty neat. It's funny because despite it being a literal Disney game, it looks indie as fuck. It's so funny. July 28th, okay. It reminds me of like Disney Castle of Illusion on like Nasty Yeah, right. What's next? Persona! Wait, Fire Emblem? No way, already? Already? Who is it? Who is it? Who is it? Who is it? Hector! Yeah, my husband! You were just talking about the two. I love him. He's my dad Let's and my husband. Go, Hector. Soren. Yes, dude. All right. I'm screaming at the radio. Let's go. Okay. Oh. Camilla, my wife. Oh my god, <laughs> mommy. Oh yeah. Who has been happy? Good dad. Come in, Robin. 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 The cool, you, it's both of them together! Oh, nice. That drip on Krom. Veron from Heroes? What? They're acknowledging it? Summon acknowledging heroes. Summon Ike? Oh my god, the summon animation and oh, everything! Nice. They actually took elements from the gacha. I'm so mad. Alright. Oh, wait for it. Hang on. A new story called Felzinalog. Felzinalog. Oh! Grimma? Thank you for answering our prayers. Oh! As if it's putting your world in no, danger. Grim has been destroyed permanently. No, come back. <laughs> Nell? Oh my god, okay. Wave two of the Fire Nell's Emblem Engage Bar. expansion. We just pass have Fire Emblem Engage game launches on the Nintendo Switch. Later oh, today? Shit. You're shitting me. People Later today? Back season, baby. Oh. Uh, All right. Hades 2? No, this isn't Hades 2. No. <laughs> this is Harmony, Harmony, the fall of reverie. A world in which deities known as Don't nod. All right. <laughs> when a megacorp endangers the harmony between reverie Facebook? and our world. Oh, there's always a megacorp involved, isn't it? In the yeah. It's always some big pharma. In this narrative yeah. adventure, harness your divine gift of Why is your name Polly? To travel between worlds. Hell between worlds. See the future. Oh, there's a tree. And decide humanity's fate. Oh, it's one of these. Okay. Story paths, along with a riveting soundtrack by Celeste composer Lena Rain. No <laughs> way. Okay. <laughs> yeah, no. That's all you had to say. You have my attention now. Inspirations like Bond. James Bond? Or power? That's not. To that's not power. <laughs> that's not power, Chainsaw Man. Which destiny do you aspire? So it's another one of those choices matter games. All right. Yeah. I am interested in the OST though. This does look nice. All right, what else you got? Oh. These games will have you roll. 
Ing. Final Fantasy. Octopath 2. Octopath Who? Travel. You're close. Yeah, right. Octopath Travel. Okay, but we've never <laughs> played Octopath Traveler. Some Nintendo people Direct, like it. A demo containing the game's opening okay, so we can at least try the demo just like we did for Triangle Strategy and whatnot. Yeah. This game looks absolutely gorgeous, but I do not care about the actual game itself. Right. The gameplay is, it's the dialogue is there, and it's like I love Octopath for its aesthetic and beauty, but for, I bought a Switch just for Octopath Traveler and ended up not liking the game. Katamari! Oh, here we go. I didn't allow, think they allow me to be distracted by Katamari. Would. Let's they go. Said roll. Yeah. Yes. Yeah! <laughs> we got the best game of all time, yeah. Katamari. You love Katamari. This is such a fun ass game. This is the I love remake this. of the second oh, game, right? Selfie camera? Selfie camera? Oh. Selfie. Oh, but for, for NSO yeah. members, all right. Well, t now I can put my NSO to no, use, all right. Sea of Stars. Oh, this looks Ooh. interesting. Ooh. Ooh, reflecting, let's go. Traversal RP, okay, so we saw Octopath Traveler and we're like, oh, this ain't impressive, but we look at this game and it's go, yeah, let's go. <laughs> this sounds like oh, interesting, wait, though. Your journey yeah, with enchanting I think it's the best traveler, but it was... Hmm. Reminds me of... Yasunori Mitsuda. Um, Yasunori Mitsuda? Mitsuda of all Yo, people? Mitsuda? Wait! This just looks like... What, was, what does it remind me of? Um, Stardew Valley, but like, Octopath Traveler, put together. Oh my god! It's coming like to the Switch! Oh, Omega Strike! Omega Strikers! Oh my god, it's coming to the Switch! Omega Strikers! Nice. Oh no. oh no, not ready. Let's go! This game is so hype, actually. Did they ever announce any DLC or updates for the Mario Strikers game? I thought the Mario Strikers game was a lost cause, but I'm pretty sure they've, they're done with it, yeah. I, think, I thought they finished the DLC cycle for it. Oh my god, character oh, designs, yo. All right. All right. Oh. Oh, what is this? Oh, son of a bitch. What the fuck? Uh, huh? Entry in Odyssey! Oh. Oh. One That's through you. three, Small let's go! Three. Nice. I fucking hate Entry in Odyssey. Why? Why? What's wrong with that? Oh, I've seen this. Who are you? I, this caught my interest. A blank map is your only guide. Oh my god. You have to draw the map. Even yes. Yeah, that's cool. Oh, right. I remember this game. Enter into the labyrinth with five Greg. As the Greg. Kill leader, you'll assign them roles like the ally defending protector or the ultra fast dark hunter. Oh my god. Be warned. Every the map making aspect was so danger. nice, yeah. Entry and Odyssey was so cool. Fall in battle, yeah. You can change your what? team and learn new skills to strengthen you know, your party before challenging the labyrinth again. Entry and Mystery Dungeon. Mm hmm. 24 newly drawn character illustrations Ooh. are included. enjoyed that game. Oh my god. Plus, take this is uh difficulty option. This is giving off some <laughs> vibes. <laughs> yeah, picnic. That's so cool. Etrian Odyssey Origins, Origins collection, collection, June 1st. Launches on Nintendo Switch. He thinks they're probably going to bring over the Persona Each Q the as well. will also be available separately on The music and everything, man. I oh, still god. Know begin today on oh. Nintendo oh. Right. Thank you, Atlas. Really cool. Oh, What's there we next? Go. Oh, get your all right, here you go. Oh my God! Oh, As you have familiar. mentioned, no way, no way, no way, no way! We got it, we got it. Let's go. Advance Wars one oh, and nice. two. Finally, oh, when are we getting? All right, now it's coming out. This Andy, time. Max, Sammy. In two full story campaigns. Yes, dude. With colorful turn-based tactics. Now we'll get to play it. Flex your strategic muscles. Let's go, Max. Fuck that thing up. Let's go. Max? All right. Plus, go head to head in local and online play. Lo local oh, and nice. online, all right. Nice. April 21st, Nintendo that's Switch so close! Right. Yeah. Yes, They're dude. really wanting that tax return. Oh, black screen. Shh, shh, shh. Kirby. Kirby. Oh, Kirby. It's Magalore. Maglor from uh, the like, Kirby's Maglor. Return to Maglor. The, game. <laughs> the mystery of the Druids. Magalore. The interdimensional traveler return to from Dreamland the main adventure okay. has lost his power. I'll play Return to Dreamland again. Shit. I'll play it for. I'll play it as many times as I can, as long as we get to see Maglor. 
Yeah, fuck. Maclor <laughs> Epilogue, right. okay? The interdimensional trap. You can play as oh, Maclor. All right, so we're gonna see like his Ooh. origin story of why he's a fuck what. <laughs> to regain Maglor's powers, you'll need to collect magic points. Oh, by magic this points. is their. Huh. Magic so this oh, is this upgrade game's, system. Uh, can be restored nice. and enhanced. Bowser's Fury. Okay, no, it's after Side he's story. getting his power back. Okay. So we get to watch Maglor grow again. All right. The order in which you restore his powers is up to you. My wallet's going to be bad. I'm going to be in so much financial debt. So this is the great maze. <laughs> Oh. I'm going into debt. Oh, four year. people. All right, four player. Let's go. I, can venture through this I expected yeah, this because Kirby game, but still. Yeah. This is, yeah, the music this is, is so nice, game. also. Mm hmm. Can Magalore restore his powers? Ooh. And safely return to his Kame, Kame, ha, ha, ha. All right. Nice. <laughs> so after you beat story mode, you can access the DLC. Cool. No way. After today's Nintendo Direct, a demo will be the Oh, you can play the demo of the YouTube game itself. All right. Nice. Thank you, Soccer. Cool. I really yeah. cool. Players can play a specially arranged demo with select stages and sub games. Shit, that sounds hype. Huh. February 24th. That's oh yeah, a couple weeks from now. Yeah. Pre-orders are available. Oh my gosh. On Nintendo we shop. Nintendo, we stop. It's oh. Nintendo. They won't. You're looking forward it's time. to the new story, story in Kirby's, Kirby's Return, Return to Dreamland Dream Deluxe. Yes. Next, here's some news about Nintendo. Oh boy, here we go. Game More Boy NSO shit. Okay, what's next? What are you doing? Oh. Huh. What? Ba ding! Wait for it. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> oh! Yes! Oh, hello. oh my god! <laughs> Super <laughs> Mario Lantern. Oh my god, Link's Awakening! Yes! Let's go! Let's go. Just like you could back in the ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Tetris! Da -da 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 -da. I could get angry all over again. They will support this service for Lines. a year, year and a half, and never touched again. Super Mario Land 2 is so good. If you guys haven't played it, I recommend it. It's one of the better Mario okay, games. It, it is. I will try it's it. It's really good. Yes, the best oh, game ever of all time. There is no contest. Give me this. Oh. Gotta get out of Koholint Island. Gargoyles Quest! Oh my god! Gargoyles Quest! Let's go! Game and Watch Gallery 3! Oh my god, this game was my entire childhood. This is cute. This is cute. It's so nice. Alone in the Dark? People oh, played this was, game? This was a game? Yes! Oh, 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 there, it oh there it is! There it is! There you there are, Nintendo! Girl. Making fun of me, you asshole! There's the girl! <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, Speak uh, of the uh, devil, um, Wario we Land 3! We were talking about oh, really. The best Wario Land right next to 4! Kirby's, Kirby's Dream Land! Alright! We can play the OG! I will swallow you and spit you out at other enemies! Yep! Remember before Kirby could copy his enemies? Oh! Filters? Game Boy, Game Boy Pocket, or Game Boy Color. All right. Nice. Up to two players can play compatible. Okay, two players. Locally or online. Sick. Cool. TCG. More games will be added. Zelda Oracle Seasons and Ages. Pokemon. Hard game. Tilt and Tumble. Card game. Oh, good. Oh, shut up! Shut up! Shut up! They did it! They finally did it! We didn't think they'd do it, but they did it! So, so are you playing next week? <gasps> no! Fuck! Oh my god, I'm gonna cry! They better. Super Mario Brothers 4-3! Super Mario pass. Advance 4. Yes! Super Mario Brothers 3. The game. Okay, yeah, so extra is, levels is, from the uh, Nintendo it even includes the e-reader levels! Wario, we, we just talked about this! We you literally just talked about this! Is my room bugged? Are I, like, I, feel like, I feel like the FBI man is sitting here. <laughs> Kuku, Kuku, we can finally yeah, play Kuda 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 Okay! After being a trophy in Smash for years, we can play it. Super Circuit! Yui! We did it! Super Circuit! The best one! Great. Yes! Wow! <laughs> Superstar Saga, oh, baby! No, we're in it now. We are in it. Nice. I can't wait to fight Sephiroth. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Minish Cap is the, the Minish oh, Cap is real. Yes, I've been wanting to play this game, and now you can on this Switch. Finally, 
Uh, is, this, is this is this the current Why roster? Please have more. Oh, four players. I hope that I can play these offline. Nope, it's gonna be oh, online. Cool. Oh, amazing mirror, fusion, fire emblem, maximum velocity, golden sun. Yo! Nice. Wow. Oh, right. but it's gonna be on NSO Premium. Oh man! Yeah. Damn it, Nintendo. Yeah. How are you gonna cock tease me like that? Put that away. Yeah. Put that away right now. <laughs> Select Game Boy. Put that away right now. Oh, will be playable. Oh, that was a cool Nintendo transition. Switch. All right, fuck off. And after today's Nintendo Direct, you'll be able to play the Game Boy cool. and Game Boy okay. Advance titles we introduced. Give us system themes, please. I want system themes. Look forward to more information Give us per game button Nintendo remapping. Switch online. They, they can't go on no. over plays and <laughs> play on the TBA. I saw that God. shit. Let's see a few more headlines. Oh, more headlines. We're not done yet. More oh, so that was real. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! No way! So that was real. Okay. The original Metroid Prime. I'm gonna cry. I'm trying so hard to keep it down right now, guys. I'm trying so hard to keep it down right now. I'm gonna cry. Oh, so Oh my God! Yes! Oh my! I'm sweating. This looks a lot better. They yeah, no! Did they upscale yeah, it? I see what they did. So what better. they've done is that they actually backported uh, the upscaled assets that they reused for three back into the original game. No so way! This is more Looks of... So, so it's more than just a re-release then? Yeah, because that's, that's, that's Ridley. Ridley! Yeah, that's Ridley's model and the lighting that they use in Prime Metroid 3. Metroid Prime Remastered! Yeah. We can finally play NPR. Let's go. All right. Oh my first God. Metroid Prime game. The first Metroid, Metroid Prime, Prime game remastered on the Switch. There's no way. No Switch. I know they're gonna bring the Switch. Yeah. Because those, the, from the perspective of those are the, these are the doors and lighting effects and everything from Prime Three. Okay. Plus, nice. plus Samus is, has a, a more more uh, polygonal render. Yeah. These are all assets from Prime Three. Okay. Cool. 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 This is still good though. Having it backported is nice. It means we get to enjoy the original the game, but from with a much qual a higher quality perspective. The thing about Metroid Prime, though, is that even though it's a 21-year-old GameCube game, it still looks fantastic. Right. Yep. Oh. Bombs. And more. Ball. Bumps. This remaster adds okay. new dual stick controls. Cool. Oh my god. We get we get control. the second stick controls. Yes. Oh my I god. Feel, I'm still gonna use the original controls. Flagra, I hate you so much. Oh pirate, let's go. Really I'm getting spoiled. You are getting spoiled. You are going you are very spoiled and I'm okay with it. When? When? I mean when when today. 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 Shut no! up! Yo! Uh, I'm buying this. Out. I'm buying this. I have no choice. I'll buy the physical oh. version. What's this? Right? Well, Iron Mouse? Iron Mouse? Iron Mouse? Yeah, that's what I saw. Yep, it's definitely Danganronpa, Danganronpa, Danganronpa yeah. Oh, I imagine they're the gonna do this. this, this artists are already, already on their drill right now. Man. There are already oh, artists on the yeah. scene. It's already. They, they, they have already they're, started drawing. They, they sketch is done. The sketch is done. Yeah, Master the Detective the Archive, the Rain Code. Each one. It's just Dengen Ronpa, guys. Oh, this is what it looks heavily like. Mimic body types. Why do these all look like Blender character models? This guy. What? That's oh. Danganronpa. Heartbeats and whispers with audio aptitude. That's not her actual oh, name. Past crime scenes with no, that's her ability. Post -con aptitude. What if their abilities are their names? I'd scream. So that means uh, Yuma Coco Head. Stop. Stop. That's not even regularly funny. <laughs> Fucking Yuma Coco Head. Shut up. Labyrinth will appear. Oh. <laughs> Objection! Consistencies and oh my god, the Reaper? Final Fantasy? <laughs> the theme here. Yeah, yeah Final Fantasy. You can tell by the C. That's definitely the Meteor logo. They're gonna get sued by Square yeah, immediately. Pretty, <laughs> pretty though. That and oh. Kaidos? 
Is this Batten this Kaitos? Flight this looks more. familiar. Why does this look familiar? Batten Kaitos, oh it is! My brother. My brother is going to fucking die because he spent so much money getting me a GameCube Originals. Oh, I'm getting lightheaded. Let me drink water real quick. Conspiracy looms closer as spirits dwelling within the protagonists. Mm. You'll stand up to the Empire across two So, Ren, for context, Batten Kaitos is basically Evolution Worlds, but if it was actually a good game. During your travels, oh, you Batten Kaitos is sick. With like -minded allies. Battles are fought using cards. God, the music. Yes. Card game. Yes, the music is so nice. Oh, so this is where the music comes from. Yes! That's what I wanted to hear. The music is so nice. I'm going to start crying, dude. Please. I'm trying so hard. That's what I wanted to hear. Split second decisions. They did it so well. Victory. What revelations will come to light in the skies above and the lands below? Ah. That's in Kaitos 1 and 2. HD remaster. Soars on Nintendo Switch this summer. Summer. Everyone's getting spoiled. Dive into your what? new fantasy life. It's a farming sim, isn't it? It looks like no, it. No, this is that uh, town game that Game Freak is working uh, on. I think fantasy oh, life, the RPG no. life. The fantasy life. Yeah. Oh, in I guess it's not. Fantasy life, game. fantasy life, the girl yeah, who steals life. time. Give it back. Give it back. Are <laughs> 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 so you afraid? Uh, patent time? You'll the girl who left through time? Girl. I'm going to send you back a thousand years. Why? Caveman times. Why? Ooga booga. We don't. Know. Like, We're not I liked the talking. original yeah, fantasy life, wrong. honestly. It was really good. Animal Crossing? Animal Crossing. Become a woodcutter. I don't want to <laughs> Become a woodcutter. Wait, yes. hold, up, hold up a second. Blacksmith. Huh. Yeah, this is that's not blacksmithing, life. that's cooking, <laughs> asshole. Uh, he said cooking at first. <laughs> Yeah, that looked like the cooking system. In this the is a very life. active combat for what it looks like, though. Animal Crossing at default pose. Yep, definitely I Animal mean, Crossing. Fantasy Life was pretty Animal Crossing with time travel and It's it's yeah, just Animal Crossing. It's just yeah. Animal Crossing. Animal Crossing is about to begin. Fantasy Life. Fantasy Life I. The girl who steals Fantasy time. Fantasy Life I. I. Right. In a single pupil. Oh, black All screen. Right. I liked the original. Professor Layton. Yeah. Is it Professor yeah. Layton? Yeah. It is the hat. Is the hat. The hat. The hat. The hat. Let's go. I literally thought this franchise was dead because Same. the past like three yeah. games they had yeah, no. sold terribly. I was just talking. Professor to Layton like, and the new about world about of Steam. This franchise. A new was. mystery will begin. That's it. That's all we're getting. Way poor. Yeah. Oh, there I it is. I was literally oh, talking yeah. to someone Where yesterday about how dead Professor okay, Layton was. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, Yoshi's, Island? Yoshi's Island. Yoshi's Island. A brand new course. The music. <laughs> okay. Yes. Yes. This is actually oh, really nice. I got all the details and everything. All right. This would be such an obvious map to put into Mario Kart that I'm kind of mad that that uh Birdo. it wasn't Birdo Birdo from, from Double Dash. Birdo. From no way. Link from Odyssey. Oh, the Let's see. The creeper. Ryu from Streets. Birdo character, as opposed to Birdo the Way <laughs> geological position. All right. As opposed to Birdo the main antagonist of All right. So what's next then? Is that it? Just Yoshi's Island and Birdo? All right. Spring. Available at no additional cost if you have NSO with EP. Okay. The DLC can also be purchased on its own. Okay. Uh, thank you. Minecraft. Oh, what's this? Holy uh, Kingdom shit, Hearts. Baseball. Yo. Or, or All Star Baseball. Oh, that has a Metal name. Network. Oh, Minecraft shit. Legends. All right. Oh, they're just going through with the last reels. Right. I mean, the big ones coming Block. up. Block. I remember Gearbox hearing of, yeah. Publishing. Oh, Block. Okay. Block, yeah. I thought it was called Gearbox Publishing. No, that's the name of the company. <laughs> this is a co-op game. This is cute. This is really cute. The entire Whoa. Mega Man Battle Network Legacy Collection. Battle God damn. Uh, All of it. Those games are so I, fun. I really hope Battle that Battle Network, Network 1 is, yeah. is the, the DS Eight remake of Battle Network. Have a nice death. I've heard a lot of people talking yeah. about this game. Yeah. Is that Points at you. Is that Ooh. WBSC bait you. Wow. All right. This game oh, exists? Oh my Japan god. That's like later today for this. 
Uh, Ted's gonna Disney Dreamlight Valley. Okay, cool. The new Kingdom Hearts update looks kind of sick, actually. Where's Kingdom. Sora? Oh, that's Simba. I want Sora. Dreamlight Imagine he just gets mauled right now. Hey guys, photo of me before. Tails of Symphonia remastered? Nice. Oh yeah, no, they announced this. Yeah. Did they announce this? I didn't yeah. see this. Yeah, yeah they announced it a while ago. Symphonia is so sick. I didn't see it either. I didn't see it either. That's news to me. Oh, Symphonia is shit. Wait for the big so one. Oh, big time, guys. Zelda. Yeah, Super ahead. Smash Brothers Ultimate 2. Let's go. Okay, we can leave. Up. Tears of the Zelda. Kingdom Marvel movie trailer. This is it. Tears of the Kingdom. Yeah. Yep. There's it's there there's the Marvel background. Movie trailer again again for Zelda again. Um, but... Uh huh. We got we got flying creatures. They exist. You know, I'm glad right. that Metroid oh. Prime Remastered was announced, but they're probably going to see how this do sales wise before they announce anything regarding to Prime Four or Prime Two Remastered. Probably. This is looking this is looking kind because of promising. they would have to do way right. too much remaster Prime Three. Camellio Skies from Monster Hunter. Rise, yep, those guys. Rise, my servants. Rise. Ganon? Who's talking? Ganon. This is what Ganon From sounds like? Ganon. This kingdom. I mean, that's a pretty good Ganon voice. I, I dig oh, whisper it. to me more. No survivors. Oh, hey, the red moon. Ganon? The blood moon rises once again. Also, Robin, that's not Ganon. He didn't say Doria once. Yeah. All right. No, that should be quiet, though. Uh, oh. What? So we have to actually fight the... Okay. Horses? Is There's it, a lot of those. Is moon actually a thing now? <laughs> Fucking Wisp said Delamut. Yeah, it's Delamut. Okay. Yeah, Delamut. Exactly. Is the right. Blood Moon actually a thing now that matters? Whoa! Oh, shit. Ooh, totems. Uh-oh. Oh! oh. oh that's man. Ganon. That looks like Ganon corpse. That's Ganon. This is yeah, that's, big. This is saw, big. Saw, that, that was uh, the Ganon corpse we saw when they announced it, yeah. This is so oh. big, dude. Oh, homing arrows? Oh. Grinding? Grinding? Yo. New weapon? All right. You gotta throw New armor. Okay. That looks sick. I get it. New armor. Okay. Oh, car? <laughs> <laughs> Literal. Nice. Oh my god, we get to fly a Holy drone? We we'll use the force, Link. <laughs> Legend of Zelda, Tears of My Wallet. Tears, Tears of My Wallet. Of oh. Tears of My Wallet. Yeah. Reverse music. Uh, the reverse music. People are <gasps> already playing it backwards. Please, lend him your power. God Link? May 12th, 2023. Legend of Zelda Nuts and Bolts. <laughs> Legend of Zelda Nuts and Bolts. What is this yeah. game? It, it's this a big ass be, game, yeah. We're gonna be out for a while. Tears of the Kingdom. God, Tears of my wallet. Available May 12th. Pre-orders begin now. Oh no, I don't like what's happening. I don't like what's gonna come through. Oh no. Collector's edition of the game. Oh, oh. there is a ah, the amiibo looks so clean. Why does he just look like a Jedi Padawan? Ah, they really want my tax dollars, don't they? They really want my tax dollars. Yes. Why does Link just look like a Padawan? That amiibo. Wait for this. I'm being robbed and I'm being robbed. They that didn't amiibo mention the price point. Jedi Do you Academy think they cut that out last minute? <laughs> that amiibo is just some Jedi. They did Academy not mention kit. the price point. Sixty nine ninety nine. They did not want to mention the price point. They knew. <laughs> they knew. Okay. Wow. Dollars per um amiibo. <laughs> oh, god. oh my god! I someone in my DMs had oh. a very good point. Was that Patrick Seitz as Ganondorf? <laughs> Hmm. Let what? me run that back Wait. really quick. Um, yeah, that was Patrick Sykes. That means in the Dio? Japanese version, by default, he has to automatically be voiced by Koyasu. Let me go ahead and run it back for both you guys in stream here Wait, real quick. Like, Hold on a second. Who, who's Patrick hey, dude uh, Joy, before you do that, can you do a thing real quick? Hold on. What, uh, yeah, no, give me Patrick, give me a second. Patrick Seitz is the English voice actor for Dio. Can you guys still see it? Oh my god, it? no yeah. way. Yeah, yeah Patrick Seitz is Dio. He's done a bunch of shit. He's in uh, Fire Emblem Three Houses too. Oh, I, I have to dial it back a little further. Sorry, hang on. Slice is in a lot of. Slice is in a lot of. Yeah, things. he's been he's a, been a lot of. Actor. He's a really he's good a... voice actor and person. Like, sorry, Twitch chat. I'm kind of playing it from two different windows. One for the Discord and one for you guys. So I'm having to play this separately. I'm so sorry. So <laughs> it's gonna be a little bit delayed. I can't wait. I need May 12th to come now. Okay. Rise, rise, my servant. That is! It has to no. be Patrick Seitz! 
The voice sounds familiar, yeah, but I can't fit. Ragnar the Blood Edge voices Ganon? Leave no what? survivors. Yeah. Did someone, uh, did someone check the, the Japanese version of it and see if it's Koyasu? I, it's probably not. It probably, I mean, I don't know. Uh, either way, no Tamadachi life. Shut up. <laughs> Fucking <laughs> the Twitch chat, or excuse me, the I'm YouTube waiting. chat's going nuts. Oh my I'm god. Waiting, I'm waiting for sites to tweet that he's like allowed to say he's Ganondorf now. <laughs> God. So, okay, thoughts initially. So, <clears throat> what are we looking forward to here? Aside from crying of the of the the castle. Um, oh. it, Advance Wars Mega Man. lived. Advance Absolutely Wars Mega lived Man. at long last. Yeah, Best. Mega Man definitely. The fact that Mega we're getting Man the entire sure. Battle Network franchise all at once is so sick. I remember playing mm -hmm. the hell out of some of those when I was younger. Mm -hmm. so Be yeah, gone, me wallet. Net Battle Network slaps. I think the uh, thing that really drove me over the edge was the new Game Boy games and then the Game Boy Advance games. And it's like, dude, that's so hype. And then they immediately like check me in both of my titties, double punch both of them and said, yeah, but you have to pay the extra expansion pass to yeah, play you them. Know, yeah. You know, these things are good, too good. Damn, to I, I, I was I was uh, kind of expecting it. But yeah, it's, it's uh, like, Pikmin uh, 4. Pikmin 4. Oh, yeah, Pikmin oh. 4 off rip definitely got me. That was so Pikmin sick. 4, Pikmin 4 immediately was just great. I guess something that they have uh, to cut out of the direct was the fact that they're going to be remaking the very first uh, Atelier game. Mm hmm. Yeah. Um, uh, Joey, before we continue, can you please check Steam? Look, if you gifted me Dead Cells, I'm probably not going to play it uh, for, for a while, but I appreciate it. Um, What's coming out today again? Uh, a lot. Metroid. A lot. A lot. Yeah, Metroid, Metroid Prime today, 1 yeah. HD. And uh, fucking mm -hmm. the, the baseball game. Yeah. The baseball game. What else is coming out today? I, wait. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that That's that's fake. Someone photoshopped the fucking in the Game Boy Advance Switch Online thing. Uh, Carnage Rally. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Attack and the power of Juju. Okay. Uh, shit, I haven't heard that name in a long time. People are bitching about Silk Song and Mother Three. Hmm. I don't know. Advanced do Wars mean? lives. That's all I need. Thank God. You mm. have oh, Kirby's returned to Dreamland. Limit. Please retry. Oh what yeah, Kirby's returned to limit? Dreamland Deluxe. I forget when that was. You get the retweet limit. Right. Oh, what the fuck is a retweet Matt actually limit? got the JP trailer. Um, give yeah, me one second. Question. Let me pull this up for. Twitch people first, and we'll go ahead and kind of hear it real quick. Um, I said yeah, stop. Twitter, stop. Twitter's busted. Everyone oh, is over the tweet limit, Japanese, even if someone hasn't tweeted today. Uh, let's see. Okay. Let me expand, or not expand, let me uh, PIP it for you guys real quick. One second. All right. I'm going to try and have these play side by side. Um, you know, I realized that they probably added the dual stick option for Metroid Prime Remastered to get more weight to people to play it, but that game obviously controls a lot better with it. It's a unique Let's see. control scheme. Um, where... God, I forgot. I have to delete one perspective for you guys and then share the other. Sorry. Yeah. Discord moment. You can't just let me... Can I just... Hold on. Does this kill it for OBS? Can you guys see it? Yeah. It killed it for OBS. Motherfucker. All right, hang on. I have a better idea. Um, why does it do that? Um, hang on a second. I have a... I'm gonna try something else. Let me see if I can run an entirely new window capture for it, real quick. I think Metroid Prime Remastered might be the first you know. Switch game that I ever buy, both physically and digitally. But then again, I also have to buy Engage in a few days. Please do. Great. Uh, let's see. You know, for some reason, whenever I stream it to Discord, it immediately kills it for OBS. It's fucking dumb. Um, I guess I'll just have to stream two different perspectives again. Hang on. Yeah, no, that's annoying, but it is what it is. Uh, let's see. YouTube, there we go. So Twitch chat, you guys can see this. So let me pull this up for you happy few here in the Discord. Some of you have already Yachty. seen it, but we're going to watch it together like a fucking family. Like a uh, family. Uh, bitch uh, sisters. Uh, can you see all of the bitch sisters? I refuse to. Is spoiled with this direct. Please tell me I didn't just stream the wrong window. Can you guys see you it? You are streaming simultaneous. Okay, good, 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 good. All right, hang on a second. I'm gonna try and play these simultaneously, so bear with me. Um, if only there was a button that lets you like play both at the same time. Thanks for the hydrate. Uh, let's see. Hmm. 
I really hope that of course, uh, like perspective cut out. I really hope that that rumor is going around in which um, hang on, no, Konami it, is planning to it just, cut out uh, for port, OBS, yeah, to port yeah, rip. Uh, so, like, so, you still like, want to try syncing it? Or? Here we go. I got it. Okay. Right. There's there's you guys' perspective, and then let me go this way, and then this way. There we go. All right. So you guys can see it now, right? Twitch chat, you guys can see it. You guys in the Discord can see it. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna try and get this as closely right as I can. I'm gonna try and get this as closely as I can. Ready? Mm -hmm. And go. Oh, I just hit play on the both on the same window. All right. Mm. Uh, boom. Stop. Tab and go. Ah, oh, fuck. I brain. Mm. <laughs> My tab <laughs> button is not working like it should. This is why we need a button to play all windows. Have everything playing Ooh. at once. Go. Rub your tummy and pat your head. Yeah. There will be a slight delay in audio chat, so. It was revealed in the Japanese version, but um. Let it fly. Let it fly. Wait, go ahead. But the Etrian Odyssey trilogy is going to have a uh, Persona DLC for it. Oh. Okay. Oh, and Megami Tensei DLC. Nice. Um. Is the Discord one broken for anyone else? Oh, no, no, there it is. It's not Dio, but it's someone else. Still Ganon. No, it's Sam. That's really good, wow. Yeah. I mean, the English was pretty good, too. Mm-hmm. Both dubs are hit on all fronts, good lord. Yeah. Hmm. Ah. I don't know, man. This game looks incredibly promising right now. It has been for a while, but this is, uh, yeah. What if it's the last Zelda game ever made? It won't be. But Zelda's too popular. No, no, it, they could say it, they say it is, but then they're Beautiful. like, two years later, Eight. they need the money. Nintendo will not ever be in a situation yeah. where they need the the, it's too much too much money on the table to ever stop making solo the fact that they possibly made aerial uh floating areas to explore just made the game new. hey remember city in the sky nope remember the miyazaki no, movie shut up waiting That's for somebody to play the music backwards to kind of hear what it's yeah, referencing no, people are already reversing i feel like we'll see that soon Oh, cool. If I could do it myself, I will. Reversing the video to hear, like, Actually, I could probably do it right now. So, although Tears of the Kingdom is $70, Primary Master is only 40 which is strange for a Nintendo game. Wait. Yeah, I thought they'd sell that shit at Yeah, I thought they would do that shit at 60 Are you saying they didn't? No. Yeah. Huh. I'm amazed. Huh. I'm actually very impressed. Way to go, Nintendo. You, uh... Yeah. You price those so games. There may be two Switch games I'm buying. Price point? Decent price point for a remaster? Damn. If only Zelda could get that on treatment. A on a Nintendo console? That's amazing. God. Okay. Well, this this was a very despite it being like, you know, only the first half of the year here, there's already a chock full of games just off rip that we can look forward to. I'm My wallet's not ready. I don't think anybody's debt. wallets are ready for this. Um, yeah, no. For for top half of the year, I'm already going into debt. Right. I Goodness think gracious. Everyone is. I'm going to be crying thing. so bad. All right. So yeah, that's actually gonna go ahead and do it. We we th this is one of the coolest directs that we've had in a while. Actually. Yeah. This it, was uh the best direct in a while. Right. Thanks so much, Joy. Appreciate oh, no. it. Thank you guys so That's much for tagging cool. in. Um, we're actually going to go ahead and raid in on somebody who's an afternoon streamer. I never get to see them, so we'll go ahead and raid in on them. They're currently playing Warframe, but you know, even if you're not going to stay, be sure to give them the same love that you give me. I appreciate you guys so much for coming out. Please make sure that you wash your hands, don't touch your face, drink water, wear a mask when traveling in public. We will see you guys on the next stream. Um, I will be streaming back on Monday. Um, I only made an exception to stream on my day off here today because Nintendo Direct, you know, I can't make up for Nintendo's timing. But um, that being said, when we get back to streaming on Friday, I will be playing uh, Pokemon Emerald for the first time. So we are going to be going through that experience 
together because I haven't played it in literal decades. So when we get there, um, just go ahead and give them a typical uh, gal raid, as you would expect, um, the same as I give to everybody else that I show love to. Um, again, thank you guys so much for coming out. Thank you guys here in Starbucks for coming out and hanging out and checking out all the funny stuff that Nintendo has to offer. And we will see you guys later. And uh, bye bye. Oh, uh. Bye, bye, you bye guys. Metroid. Bye, bye Metroid, by the way. Bye yeah. Metroid. Bye Metroid. In please Advance Wars. Bye Metroid. Bye Metroid. Bye Advance bye Wars. Advance, for the <laughs> love of God, please. <laughs> See you guys later. Nah. Do not let Nintendo forget that Advance Wars exists. Oh,